Are you a student taking online courses this semester? Yes? Then you're gonna wanna listen to this. I'm Joanne and I'm a learning strategist here at Centennial College. And today I'm gonna to share some strategies that will help you to become a better online learner. Now, if you've never taken an online course before, you may notice that there are some key differences between online versus traditional in-person classes. Online courses are great in that they can offer more flexibility and convenience, but they can also be quite challenging. So it's really important that you stay on top of your studies. Today, I'd like to share my top three tips on what you can do to set yourself up for online learning success. Tip number one, ensure you know the details of how your course will be delivered. Make sure to read through all the information you've received, including your course shell on eCentennial. This is super important. This is where you can find out whether you will have to log on and watch a live lecture at a specific time, or if you'll be able to access the content at a time that's more convenient for you. If you're not able to locate this information, then you should definitely contact your instructor and ask for some clarification. Tip number two, make sure you have the required equipment. Now, in order to be successful in your courses, you need to ensure that you have access to the appropriate technology, such as a computer, laptop or tablet, as well as a stable internet connection. Did you know that Centennial has a device loan program? Through this program, there will be a limited supply of devices available to loan to Centennial students who require them in order to complete their programs online. Centennial Libraries also offers a peer technology support program where you can connect with a peer technology mentor who can help you to learn how to navigate the platforms used here at Centennial. Tip number three, treat your online course like any other course, meaning that you show up online and on time, prepared and ready to participate. Get in the habit of regularly attending all your lectures and completing your assigned readings too. It's best to start building these good habits and making specific plans now in order to increase your chances of success, both in school and in your future career, as these are skills that employers will be looking for as well. So thanks for watching today's tips. Be sure to stay well and study hard. You've got this.